welcome back to Val Feeds, the City Construction Challenge Based. How are y'all doing today? I'm doing wonderful, and I got something to show you guys. So I've been over here, kind of clean up some land a little bit, using some of this excess dirt to cover over some uh, little lakes. I probably should have actually filled them in so I didn't hear the water sounds. Like I'm starting to do over here. But I heard some click clacking of some skeletons, and I went digging, and I found that. I haven't broken into it yet, but I did not place this cobble. So you know what that means? It means it's a dungeon. Oh yeah, let's put on my little cap. I can hear him. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's do... So this is the other side, okay. And the water is just like right over there, so... These are chests. Hi, buddy. Get some light in there. That's how we'll tackle this. <laughs> Actually, let's go around. Let's go around this way. Or should I put that light right there? I think I did. Oh, no, I put it on the wall. Good. So, my plan here, I mean, I could just rush in there, you know, but I don't really have much armor here. We're playing in the Stone Age. So, we need to kind of get in here safely. Okay, here's some other mobs. I definitely want this mossy cobblestone though. And, you know, loots. Fat loot. Come on, skillies. Come on over here. Let's see if they're smart enough. Should they not see me? See, I don't have any ranged weapons. I don't have any bows or anything yet. Hmm. All right. Let's put over here. Ho ho! Shoot that wall. Hey. <laughs> Come on, get some. Get some. What you got? Nothing. Ho oh, ho. I think that's it. Oh, one more. A couple more. Oh, that side over there is still dark, so they're still spawning. Alright. Oop, that one hit me. Alright, we're going to continue around. It is not light enough. Hmm. Alright, looks like we're gonna have to just man up and go in there. Yes, hit each other. Whoa, there's a lot. Oh man. Let them fight each other. That's probably the best thing that can happen. Oh, so cool. Marble cave too. It's pretty neat. I'm a fan. They still fighting each other? Nope. Come get it. Come on, guys. Huh, 
They're not so smart. I wonder why they're going around. Well, let's see the tasty loots. Kill these ones off. And we'll be good. One more hit, one more hit. Victory. Oh yeah. Cool, not a very big cave either. Oh, it's a marble cave though. Mm, yeah. No thank you. All right, let's see what we got. Thomium Ho. Wheat, wheat. Fortune, fortune, silver, pretty weak. Come on, portal gun. Yes, portal gun. Ah, this is portal gun. Oh, nice. Silver, iron, steel, another bucket. Oh, man, we got a portal gun. The best thing possible. Let's get out of here with our, our fat loots. And now we got a spawner too that we can use. This will be uh, really good. Come in here and mark it. Uh, waypoints, new waypoint. Skelly spawner. All right, uh, let's figure out what we're gonna do for the rest of the episode. Welcome back everyone. I'm taking the boat down the river from the lake in my town down to the mining camp. Oh, here's the hard bend. Oh no. There we go. It seems to always happen. I don't slow down enough cruising down and then I hit that hairpin right there. There's only the one. Otherwise, it's a pretty smooth ride. All the way over here to our little disembarking area. I could keep going a little bit over that way, but it kind of just stops. So hop out here. And the mine camp is right here. I need to put some, you know, more houses and like a mining well over here for some water. But right now we just got the mining shack. So, now that I got this awesome portal gun, uh, the villagers and I have been experimenting with it and figured out how to make it work. Push the buttons, there's some buttons on it, figured out what they do. I got a purple one here you can see, already turned on. Where's that blue? Eh, it's kind of hard to tell, it looks kind of like blue. But now it does a, a cyan one as well. Now from here I can head all the way back to there. Oh, come on. First time it's actually gotten me stuck. I'm in this piece. It's taking portal gun. Well, there we go. I'm gonna be stuck over here too. Oh, of course. Can I go back in? Oh, no. this one. I'm like half in each. Haha. <laughs> because there's a hole there, I'll just fall in. Sweet. So if you fall down, it seems to work. So if I was to say, or no, put it up. I'm alright if I fall down. Hmm. Okay, cool. Well, there you go. So you fix that. So let's just put that like right there. Cool. And I can fix my floor. Now you may be wondering, how am I wearing this awesome steel armor? Well it was in one of those dungeon chests. 
Just like this portal gun. I can use it because I found it. It doesn't mean I know how to make it. I can't make any more of them. But I can sure use these. I can push them buttons. And who knows, maybe playing with these portals, I'll figure out something uh, else to do with portals. Who knows? Alright. Well, while I'm here, I'm going to do some mining. And easily carry the materials back home. Ah. <laughs> Alright folks, let's see, because uh, I want to get started on the lumber mill project, so I need a little bit more stone, a little bit more wood, I'm actually probably okay on wood, but uh, I can definitely use some more stone, so I'm going to do some mining, and we'll get started on that project. Okay, so here we are in the area that I've chosen to be where the water mill is. Basically, it's where this uh, bay inlet turns into the river, kind of right where it turns into the river. I'm doing it over here and not over by the river in that area because that'll be the upper district. I want to keep the mill in the farming district. So I use my awesome portal gun to set up a portal back to the storage room. But for the time being, I've got materials that I need on me. We'll go and get some other stuff as we need. So let's kind of figure out the basics. I'm going. I'm modeling this after a, uh, a lumber mill from Skyrim. I really like that game. Looking at the mini map, let me zoom in a little bit here. We're kind of going where it's pretty straight. So let's think about like here. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. So one, so it's one, two, three, four. Uh, let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go like, let's try eight. I think that's eight. Hmm, don't think that's long enough. So I'm not doing the whole, let's see, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, let's try 13. Just like that. There we go, I think that's a little bit more appropriate, appropriate length. Let's see, let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's something like that. I think I can go wider than that. Nine, ten, eleven. First thing I did was use the sickle here from Red Power to clear away all the stuff here that I didn't care about. So over here, here, line them up. There we go. Hmm. Think about size. I think that looks pretty good. Okay, let me lay some uh, other basic foundation here. Give you guys a good idea what it's going to look like before we uh, wrap up. Alright everyone, this is what I've got so far. Box, raised it up, added some cobble, base. Got some stairs on either side. Some fences, some more stairs. I'm modeling this like I said after the Skyrim one. And I'm starting the water wheel over here. What I got so far. Let's get back the stairs. So I'm just kind of making a circle out of staircases around this. Like so. Now I'll 
repeat that pattern on the bottom side in the water. There's my little water wheel. And then I'm going to put a, a roof on top of this, just a simple slanted roof, just like that over there, out of oak. I got some stairs left here, and plenty of wood. And I'll call it pretty much done. I'm just going to have like a big, uh, you know, log laid in here and like a cutting thing. I don't have iron bars yet, I can't use iron bars yet, but that's okay. And then I can like stack up some logs over here in the corner. Hmm. Since these connect, I won't do it right here. You see I got a log turner. That's so cool. Stack some more up here. And eventually, like I said, I'll be able to put that here. The iron bar. Make it look like we're sawing up this log here. Finish the wheel, put the roof on, we'll call it done. Nice little lumber mill. I think it'll look cool. Uh, let me try and finish this roof here. See if we've got time. Alright, well, my crops are doing good. You can see they're all pretty much grown. I gotta go and do some harvesting. Because I have finished my lumber mill. What do you guys think? I think I did a pretty darn good job following my uh, style that I'm doing here. The log in the middle, this little end cap. Just a simple covering. The water where we got some lights. I gotta have a torch, one torch here on the floor. It's kinda dark here. I gotta figure out some way to get some light down from here. For now, cause I'm like, I don't, I'm gonna get rid of torches on the ground. But uh, yeah, I like it. Comes out pretty cool. Let's take a look over the water, what it looks like on the other side. With the water wheel. Nice and simple, easy build. And we got our portal gun. Things are going good. Well, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you all next time.